love to say, son of a bitch, the same of you who hates most Nintendo shit. I'm the one who calls games what they are. I even own a 360 and hate Gears of War. Guy who spends his money on games, fuck a car, just a funny guy who became a YouTube star. I don't think there's ever been a better example than Def Jam Icon for graphics over gameplay. Um, I think I was a, a little too nice when this first came out. I'm gonna have to level the score. Def Jam, ugh, oh, Def Jam. I personally loved Def Jam Vendetta and, um, and New Fight for New York, I think it was called. Um, those were awesome games. They were just real fun to play, and they weren't deep or anything, but they were fun. This game suffers from many problems in the gameplay department. And the best department in this is the graphics. I will get to all of that. Uh, if you're a fan of this, I wouldn't recommend watching the rest of this review because I pretty much shit on this fucking game. Uh, the story in this game is just all over the place. Unlike the last one where it didn't take itself seriously, but it was still enjoyable and had some really good scenes, this game is just dumb. Basically, you're building a label, and the way you're building this music label is not by paying, the, paying these artists to join your label. No, you fight their battles, which you repeatedly fight the same four or five fucking people over and over again until you fucking kill them, but they never die even though you throw them in a fire. Yes, the story is... Retarded. And there's some good scenes, but that's it. The story is just dumb. The graphics are usually the best part. The models look good. The background looks good. Um, like I said, you can you can look at them and they actually look like the real rappers. This is probably the best part of this game. Um, very good. Even up to today's standards, they're pretty damn good. So like every other fighter, you pick uh, your fighter. Problem right away that I'm going to address that I really hate is to pick a fighter. Say you want to pick a different fighter. There is a huge, huge loading factor. Okay? I mean, 7-8 seconds is just um, too much for me. 7-8 seconds for each time you look at a different rapper is unacceptable. And the fighting is so basic. Like, what the fuck happened to all the finishers from the last game? I mean, those finishers were over-the-top bullshit, but they were awesome. In this game, the main thing is basically kick, 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 maybe throw to the side. And then when they're down, you do this invisible, like, uh, DJ thing. You smash it to the floor, and then you get... You know, the environment changes, and you hear your song that you put your rapper to. And you get, like, more powerful. I'm serious, that's the main fucking point of this every match. And it gets boring after the second fucking match in this game. I was just so disappointed, and I'm like, where the fuck is those awesome moves where the guy jumps off a wall and fucking drop kicks your face like a bitch? No, instead you can just repeatedly punch, 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 and kick, and then they fall on the floor. Pathetic, boring, simple gameplay. The online is just, what the fuck, suck. Nobody plays online. I mean, all in all, this game gameplay is... Media court to the fucking bone. Very simplistic, bastards. As I said, the online is pretty much gone, and when it was active when I first bought this game, yeah, it was lagging like a bitch. The matches are extremely simple, the story mode is short as hell. I'm talking about five, six hours. Uh, it, it has all these options like create your own character, own soundtrack, and all this shit. But in the end, it, it doesn't really measure up to anything, and you don't feel this game reached its full potential. Especially after two games that, in most people's opinion, was very well done. Even to people who didn't like rap. So, I'm sorry, Def Jam, but you fucked up big time, and hopefully Def Jam 4 fixes your mistakes. I can't give this much higher than 6.6 .6 at top. And it only gets that because it's not broken or has shitty graphics.